When they were first matched, Nathan Cleverly was a fresh-faced talent on the rise, challenging an unpredictable, volatile champion. What a difference five years makes. Now Jürgen Bremer has reinvented himself as a model of German efficiency and consistency, while his Welsh rival is the man whose temperament is questioned. Five years in the making, I'm so happy now that we got this fight underway. Myself, fighting Jürgen Bremer, so happy and I believe this is my destiny. Cleverly has learned the hard way exactly how tough life at the top can be. Crowned without that defining fight against Bremer, a title reign that promised so much was brought to an abrupt and vicious end as the rampaging Sergei Kovalev sent him into a boxing wilderness. I became world champion at such, such a young age, 24 years of age. I was so young to become world champion and achieve my dream. And I had six defences of the title. And then I lost the title against the pound for pound, one of the best pound for pound fighters in the world in Kovalev. I was 26 at the time. Maybe it was too early. You know, maybe it was a bit too early for me. Now the Kevin Forrest star has his shot at redemption. <laughs> After failing to shine against Tony Bellew up at Cruiserweight, there were signs Cleverly was getting back to his best in a defiant defeat against Andre von Fara. It was a world record amount of punches thrown. It was an absolute slugfest of a fight. So that, that showed my desire is there and it's, it's, it's burning, it's, it's, uh, it's firing. At 37, time could be running out for Bremer, but his longtime rival will need to use the lessons he's learned and recapture his old fire to dethrone the Southpaw WBA belt holder. Here we are ready to, to right the wrongs, you know, and, and do it properly, you know, and the new. And uh, it's, it's going to be awesome.